Hello there people from YouTube, how you doing? Hope you're alright, I'm Alex. Welcome or welcome back to my channel or better yet, welcome back to December. We've, it feels like we went back for six months at the beginning of the year. It's crazy cold these days. Hence, that's why I'm wearing like super heavy and long hoodie. Anyway, today's video is going to be another Dimash reaction. I got many, many comments under my Dimash um, videos and many of you told me to listen to Olimpico. So that's what we're going to do today. Listen to Olimpico. I'm pretty excited. I'm in love with his voice it's one of the favorites that i have so far from all the artists that i've listened to and i can't wait to listen to it but before we get to the video don't forget to subscribe if you're new give this video a like if you enjoy it also go check out my other dimash reaction i have other singers and groups reactions so go check out my channel maybe you find something else that you will like to watch and also go follow me on Instagram. I will leave you the link in the first pin comment down below. That being said, let's get to the video. The drama already. <laughs> uh huh. Wow. I didn't expect it would be Italian, honestly. I, I'm pretty sure you told me, um, but I didn't expect the entire thing. I've, what I'm assuming is going to be the entire performance in Italian. And for those of you who don't know, if you're here for the first time, I'm Italian. And I always get excited whenever I hear someone singing in my language because it's it's awesome to see how good uh, people that are not Italian uh, are with singing in Italian. I really, really appreciate it. Every, every single artist that I've watched so far uh, singing in Italian was uh, really great. Yeah, Dimash singing in Italian wasn't expected for today. So, yeah, it was, it's really, it's really cool. Uh Ooh. You know what? It reminds me a lot of one of the songs in in the DreamWorks movie from the 90s, the Prince of Egypt, I think it is in English, the name, I'm not sure. In Italian is Il Principe d'Egitto, which is basically the story of how Moses uh, freed his people from Egyptian slavery. There's a song in the movie, the melody of that song in the movie reminds me a lot of this melody here. It's he's singing, and I love like I'm a I'm a sucker for second voices in bo in, in songs. I I already have goosebumps. Oh. There are so many people. Ooh. Wow. It's impossible. <laughs> That's so good. That's awesome. Oh, 
It's impossible. I still get amazed by these awesome singers, artists. His voice is... I don't, I don't even know how to describe it. It's really awesome. <laughs> it's the, for lack of a better word, honestly, but... I appreciate a lot how he was singing with this deep voice and then this fine, thin, high voice in the second part of the song. It's so cool. Whoa! How does he do that? How can you do that? It's like he's singing with two different people. Wow. <laughs> wow, he's unbelievable. How does he go so deep and so high in I, I, like 0 0.0001 millisecond? He changed his voice completely. It, it was like listening to two different people singing at the same time. I don't know how he does it. I, I, I said it before, I get amazed by him every single time I watch uh, his performances. I've been, I've been watching live videos of him because I, I feel that his potential is even better in live uh, performances than instead of just watching um, music videos. Because, like, when, when he sings in music videos, like, it, it's recorded in a studio and live is completely different. I like live versions of songs more um, because it it tells it it shows you how high the potential of an artist is, and his potential is so so elevated. I don't know, like the ground is here, and his potential is over the over the top of the over the sky. I don't know whatever over the space it's crazy he's probably one of the best artists i've watched so far honestly um i loved the production of of the song it's rare to hear some opera lyrical song that you would actually listen to uh in a theater play with this production under it i mean i'm not uh, an expert in opera but i've been to a few uh theater plays and the music was never this powerful, never um, this pop, I would say. Uh, a mix of pop and opera, lyrical music. And it was pretty awesome. It was so powerful. The drums were amazing. Uh, the backup singers. Every single instrument in this production was awesome i know it's made by his friend igor and uh from what i from what you told me um they performed many songs together i'm, I'm not sure if igor is the producer of every song dimash plays but i'm pretty sure that he is involved in a lot of dimash performances and dimash songs so i really like how they the two work together igor uh igor it's a really amazing composer uh, and uh, from what I learned from you he's not longer with us and I'm so sorry because 
I think the music world lost a really brilliant mind, honestly. So yeah, wow, that was a that was a journey. And how many people were there? Like it's crazy. It was I don't know if it's a stadium or a theater. I don't know where he is singing, but it's it seems pretty full, if not full to the brim with people. And also, I just want to spend one second. Uh, talking about the lights and the effects he had on the background on the stage going on all the people with uh black suits and playing with the flashlights crazy awesome and i think it added a lot to the performance having having all the um laser lights and the people with the flashlights in the background was it made the performance even better even more chilling honestly like i got goosebumps for the entire song because of his voice and because of the performance going on in the back was it it was like a really nice puzzle scene all together awesome dimash is it's becoming one of my favorites really really fast anyway that's it for today's video uh let me know in the comments what you think about this performance you watched uh the live performance or if you watched uh the video per the, the music video or if you watched both and let me know which one is your favorite dimash song in the comments down below it would be really really appreciated also if you're new to the channel subscribe give this video a like share it with your friends and come follow me on instagram i will leave you the link in the first pinned comment down below we can talk more about dimash or whoever is your favorite artist or band or whatever you want to talk about just come follow me we could be friends i would really appreciate to have you there also thank you for sticking with me so far i'll see you in the next video bye